Say there, mirror, mirror on the wall, who's the fairest of them all, noob, noob? Now there, son, don't you mean, don't, don't you mean the widest of them all? Ho oh, ho, noob noob, did you know there are now dueling rival Snow White movies? Black and white cookie, baby, let's get it. Yes, the conservative media empire, Daily Wire, has released a teaser trailer for Snow White and the Evil Queen. They used their white out. And uh, it's starring YouTuber Brett Cooper. Following that is. backlash over Disney's upcoming Snow White starring Rachel Zegler, the Zegels. So she's from she's from oh she was in Shazam too. Yes, she was. I actually so here th- there's going to be one of my big complaints is uh yeah I'm playing the the Hollywood Reporter talks about like now there's dueling Snow Whites and which one's going to be the bestest of them all. Um, you watched the trailer, correct? The the, the fifty nine second yes trailer. Yes, I did. Uh, teaser, teaser, teaser. I yes. what I, I what I want to recognize is um that there is a squirrel trying to get a, get his nut on. That looked like an AI squirrel. <laughs> it did look like an, an AI squirrel attacks. And then I also noticed that um. I don't think she's as good looking as she should be because I've seen other images of her, but I guess they didn't want her makeup to be modern. So I'm like, I don't know what's going on here. So what I figured we would do today is review the two girls and decide which one is the fairest. Well, which one's going to be the winner? Which one are you taking home tonight? Let's debate it. Rachel Zegler. I'll take home Gal Gadot. That's fine. <laughs> you just you just want Gal Gadot. You're like, yeah, they're both ugly. But. I'm a pa- I'm gonna take a hard pass on this one, dog. And uh, I'm I'm gonna. How about you f Mary kill Gal Gadot? Co- uh, what's her name? Brett Cooper and Rachel Zegler. We could talk about the. Uh, oh, actually, I think I might kill the Brett Cooper one. She looks a little downsy. <laughs> oh and, my god. Uh, and I I would f. Ziggler, because she's like okay in certain lights. Uh huh. And uh, obviously, you marry y'all get out. The sex comes with that. Okay, obviously. <laughs> what do you? So, but based on what you've seen from that, okay, let's do them as Snow Whites. Then let's just leave it to Cooper and Ziggler. What are you thinking about? Because I can give you some pros and cons for each one. Uh, well, I I think they are very different colors. <laughs> And, what? Uh, How dare you? I if uh, I you saw the you saw the the picture I used for this. They both look China white. It, well, oh, I mean, you you thought I looked at that picture? I the one picture that I sent you? Yeah, I didn't. The look one at that's it. on your phone that you could literally yeah. look oh, at I right could now. Look at it right now. Hold on. You let's, could. Let's investigate. Uh, that, oops, still farting. <laughs> um, he's such a loser. Oh wow, she does. She looks pretty crisp. She looks real bad in that picture. Like which one? Ooh, the Rachel Zegler. Okay, so and because I've seen Zegler in several lights, where I was like, "Yeah, uh, she's not. She's all right in in Shazam." Yeah, she's okay in Shazam. How about West Side Story? I know you saw that. Never gonna watch that. Don't want to watch it. <laughs> Basically, only Shazam. She looks okay in, and I don't know who the hell this you know Brett. Morgan Cooper and she's a YouTuber and uh, here's the one big criticism I'm going to lay across both like as far as depicting Snow White I have no reason to believe that Brett Cooper can act her way out of a paper bag and at least know at least I know that Rachel Zegler can act on some level and sing and potentially sing I I guess because she sang what West Side Story Na 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 America, na 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 America. I don't know that that I've never seen that, so I just know that thing is from it. And I know there's like competing street gangs named Sharks, and it's like gangs of New York, but singing and gayer. <laughs> I want to say the Torpedoes. Who's the other gang? The Sharks and the. You have no idea what I'm talking about. The, the um, what's the the other the gang? Torch. What's the Tiki Torch people? Is it them? I don't... 
I don't know. The special the case. Rich, the rich men north of Richmond. Is it, is it them? <laughs> is it the rich men north of Richmond? It could be. It could be. Uh, okay, well, let's go. How about their personality? So, Brett Cooper. I don't give a shit about that. Oh, really? You don't care that one's conservative and the other one is like a... I think she said that she doesn't need no print saving her and other Oh, God. Such... Is that what Ziegler said? Yeah, yeah. She, uh, re, they had to rewrite, you know... Uh, Snow White was made in 1937, and they had updated. She has her own wants and dreams, and she's going to be the leader that she needs to be. And then Brett Morgan's like, give me that dick, Brett baby. Cooper? <laughs> Brett Cooper? Brett Morgan? Where do you keep getting Brett Morgan from? Brett Toolman Taylor. I don't know. Oh, okay. How about this? Zegler's 22 years old. Not Zegler. Old a Cooper. Enough? Cooper's 22. Oh, Zegler's Cooper's probably 22. like 30 or something. I don't know how old she is. Uh, I mean, she's, uh, I've never heard of both are too old life. for you. Yeah. I was, what, I don't need in the twenties. <laughs> I want those eggs as fertile as they can be. Comment section with Brett Cooper. That's the name of her YouTube channel on Why the daily one. Sydney Watson. I feel like we need Sydney Watson on here. <laughs> Do you think they should have made her snow? White? Yeah. She seems a little too temperamental and she speaks with an Australian accent. You know what? I didn't see not a single dwarf, not one. I need me some dwarfs. I need yeah, seven I the, of them running the a train. Um, tiny people. What are they called? No, uh, the, the magical creatures of varying sizes and genders. Oh, that's right, because they're not all tiny. No, they are magical creatures of varying sizes and genders. Is that the actual description? Uh, as far as I understand it, it is. I okay. mean, <laughs> I mean, that's what the... Uh, yeah, it says it right here. This is the Hollywood Reporter, so they they must not be. I mean, they're not they're not on cons, they're not conservative, and they say uh, here's their line. They say, for, "Well, I I don't know if this is the criticism that conservatives are taking. They're criticizing a Latina star, Zegler, as a character described in the original Brothers Grimm story as having skin as white as snow, and the production changing the formula titu- titular." formerly titular seven dwarves into a diverse collection of magical creatures of varying sizes and genders that can that has to be that has to be like studio speak right they had to do that right we saw the pictures of them they yeah, are I, unless they were fakes they could i have thought been they were baristas oh no what did we find out they're not fa- they were stand-ins that's what they are oh, that's right yes what if they're like half animated and those those were just like body doubles the tiny people were on strike. The regular people were in there. Ah, uh, yes. <laughs> they just regular normal sized people. It's Mini Sapta or Sagra or whatever the hell. Mini that's Sag- right. <laughs> Uh So I saw no dwarfs. So they have not solved the dwarf problem yet. Daily Wire. I we are calling you out for not re- resolving. Apples. That. I like that there was apples. Okay, she does bite an apple. It's poison, so you can suck the poison out. Who's gonna be? Who's gonna be the um, the evil queen? I no one knows. No one even knows if this is real. Like they just announced it. What if I told you that Brett Cooper was off the market? She is no longer single. She just announced that she got engaged. What if the evil queen engaged. is Kyle Dunnigan playing Nancy Pelosi? <laughs> I mean, that's a possibility. Oh dear, I'm so nervous. <laughs> that I, see, I would like that. Actually, I'd watch that. I think I could do his Nancy Pelosi. I'd do a pretty good Kyle Dunnigan impression. He's uh yes he he has the fresh prince of prince prince fresh prince of prince of what the hell's the name of that show fresh prince of Persia <laughs> fresh prince of Bel Air is that what it, the I don't know what the name of his show is but it's Kyle Dunnigan he does a great job did yeah. you did you watch the Taylor Swift no you did I did not do no. that either <laughs> you what is wrong with you you literally have nothing to do and you do not you do you live up to it you do nothing I just get distracted I'm like oh look at that look at wall to stare wall. at oh, oh, oh. Yeah. I could stare at a wall <laughs> so have we made a decision are we Team Zegler oh my gosh we should make we should make shirts Team I- Cooper Team Zegler. I'm I'm Team Godot, but I think if I had to pick one, I <laughs> if you have no choice, honestly, I might pick Ziegler. I don't know. So I think you know uh, Cooper being conservative is probably not that much fun in the sack, and uh, Ziegler being a wide-eyed liberal young woman, <laughs> I'm sure she's a she's a ton of fun. And I mean, she is a little man-hating, so but that might come out in a good way, you know. Yeah. A little punishment never hurt anyone, right? 
It didn't. No. She, I'm I gonna say. Pushed around. I'm gonna say Ziggler's gonna win this one in the long run because I just, uh, if you go by quality of the movie, I just don't see this Brett Cooper girl acting like it's gonna oh, be I real tough. I don't know if the Disney one's gonna be a quality movie, but sure. Oh, it's not going to be a quality movie, but it won't be so bad that people are like, because I, I did eventually watch the Little Mermaid remake, or some of it. I didn't watch all. I couldn't make it all the way. It was just boring. So yes, well, E.T. starring as the Little Mermaid wasn't <laughs> great. So. It's not great, but she could still act and sing. So I mean, it wasn't the worst thing I've ever seen. You know, it wasn't unwatchable. It was just bad. Like the CGI was bad. And the songs weren't as good as the original. And she's just fine as as Ariel. She's just weird because she looks a little like a fish. I mean, maybe it makes more sense because she looks more like a fish than Ariel does. If she just stayed as a fish, that would that would make sense. Well, you know, her eyes, that whole eye issue. She's got them she like hammerhead like a, shark. Avatar. Oh, she looks like a Navi. I thought she looked yeah. like a hammerhead shark, but you can go with Navi. Right? Yeah, she looks like a black Navi. That's going to be the third movie. <laughs> what do you mean? A what Navi? A black Navi. A blobby. A bl- uh, there are red Navi at, at some point, too, I, I, uh, yeah. I believe. So there she. Can't there be black ones? Well, there are blue ones, and didn't Zo- uh, Zoe. And lighter sound blue ones. Lighter blue. <laughs> when will they get a shade that you're more favorable towards? <laughs> the the ocean blue and the, the light blue Navi. <laughs> you're hoping they go an even lighter yeah. shade of blue. That should be the title of, of your first book. The Lightest oh my God, Shade Avatar of Blue. Avatar 5, The Lighter Shade of Blue. <laughs> You're just waiting for it, huh? And then it's just Navi is just fucking all day. <laughs> you, you clearly saw my Disney review of the Navi, did you not? I, I I actually did watch that. Okay, good. Good for you. I didn't listen to what you said. About good. For, that's what I said. <laughs> it's good for you. Good. Oh, did you really? Yes, that is 100% what I said. Oh, shit. Yes. So, all right. So, I think how so in the sack we're going with. <laughs> this is. The, <laughs> I just wanted to sum it up. Who who are you Zegler. going? With? Yeah, Zegler. Zegler. Okay, and then in the movie we're going with Zegler. Yep. So the win goes to Zegler. Sorry, all you Brett Cooper fans out there. We we we're t- we're an impartial judge because we still don't, don't know care. Who Brett Morgan is. But... <laughs> you saw her picture. You saw a picture. I did. You didn't see any other pictures though. Why is she a YouTuber? What does she do? She comments on, just like you do nothing, she does nothing. Oh, really? Yes, she just comments on on nonsense. Why is she famous? Because she's a mildly attractive YouTuber. That's pretty easy. If you're a female and you're a YouTuber, you're going to have a following. So you're saying we should get pocket lesbian on here? The the, no comment? (laughs) No comment. We can Uh, have a new mascot. There you go. They're a co-host, mascot, producer. There you go. So there you have it, folks. We apologize if you are a giant Brett Cooper fan because, you know, we just don't... I haven't seen enough to know that she can act. And I, 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 we'll see if there's a longer trailer. Maybe we'll comment on that as well. If but it's real. If it is real. It may just be a giant troll. That is entirely possible. So we'll keep you informed. Let us know in the comments if we're total uh, dopes for committing to the wrong person. Tell us if you think Noob Noob has his head screwed on wrong, although his ultimate vote goes to Gal Gadot, so I, I suspect he wins in the long run. As it should. As he should. And uh, be sure to catch our full-length audio podcast. You can listen to it on iTunes, Stitcher, and Spotify, but you can also catch the live stream here on YouTube Friday night, 7.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. You can also do some other channels, too, but we don't talk about them because all hail YouTube. We love you. They're the best. So as for us, we're on to the next one.